a lot here. You get in shape, you get great work, great spawn. Look forward to an upcoming fight. I know you work with Jeff. Uh, tell me what it's, what's it like working with Jeff Mayweather? It's a different feel. I worked with Roger several years ago, and uh, now I'm working with Jeff. Uh, two different night and day. Are you been a victim of a doom session or two? Yeah, I've been a victim of the doom. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you know, what's it like as far as the club goes? I mean, lots of talented guys in here as far as the other places you've trained. What, what's the vibe like here compared to there? Well, it's a great atmosphere being here. Everyone is um, like family here. You work out, you talk, you go out to eat sometime with each other. Uh, me and Roger and a couple other guys going bowling tonight, kick some butt. You a better bowler than, than those guys? I'm going to show them I can do it with the right hand instead of the left. All right. Um, you had fought uh, Floyd Mayweather before. A lot of you know. You gave him one of his best fights. Obviously, what are your recollections of the of your time in the ring with that guy? It was a great experience to be in there with a legend, one of the greats. Um, his timing is very on point. What kind of uh, challenges is he gonna? What, what's Manny Pacquiao not realize he's gonna have to deal with when he's looking across from this guy? Well, we know Manny Pacquiao. He likes to counter punch. Also, Floyd is a great counter puncher. So it's about timing and accuracy. Manny um, don't have enough accuracy as Floyd has. He throw a lot of punches, but he's not as accurate as Floyd is. And that's going to be the downfall in the fight. Floyd's more accurate than Manny Pacquiao, and he places his punches better than Manny Pacquiao. When you fought him, I, you know, I'm sure you'd look at tape and stuff before. Was it a lot different when you're actually looking at something than opposed to when you're watching something on a video? From me fighting Floyd and then watching the video, I seen what he was doing when he was placing the shots, and um, he does that a lot in his fights. A lot of people don't notice it, but he's very particular about where he's punching at. He's not going to waste a punch. I know you haven't worked with him yet, but you're here to be one of his sparring partners. How did that all come about? How did they approach you? Uh, well, I've been hoping that this fight would happen with him and Manny for the last couple of years, and um, I just knew, hopefully, if it ever happened, I would get a chance to work with Floyd again because I worked with him for the Zab Judah fight and the Sean Bay Mitchell fight. So when you go back in there, you kind of look at it as almost like your rematch? <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm just finally wrapping it up. I know you guys can't get into specifics and all that kind of stuff and keeping the, the secrets in the house here, but you know, from what you've seen, I mean, how how's he? Uh, you know, is he, is he taking this one a little more serious? I mean, after he always takes everything seriously. <laughs> Obviously, that's why he's the you know the best that you know because as hard as he works, but is it a little extra gear this time? This is the first time I ever seen him take it as serious in any camp that I've been in with Floyd, and I've been in like three of them. And I also was out here working when he was getting ready for Madonna fight. Um, but it's more serious, and he's more focused. You know, this is a big fight for him. And do you, do you sparring partners? You got to take it. Uh, do you guys have a little personal thing amongst yourselves so you can get the best work? Uh, with me, I'm a veteran. It's nothing personal. It's always business. Um, I stay focused when I'm in there. And my game plan is to emulate Manny Pacquiao, to let Floyd see some of the things that he's going to bring to the table. And then for you as a fighter yourself, when are you looking to back, get back in the ring? Obviously, this puts you back a little bit, but when when we see you back in there? Uh, hopefully, um, I get the fight on Floyd Card April the 30th um, out here in Vegas. And then you're going to call him out after you win? Call who? <laughs> call Floyd out? <laughs> you get I'm, I'm a lightweight 135. I ain't messing with them big guys no more. All right, girl. Appreciate it. We'll talk to you some more soon. Thank you.